Ever wondered what's in the skincare products you use daily? It's a question that doesn't cross our minds often enough. We all have a daily skincare routine, right? From the face wash we use first thing in the morning to the moisturizer we apply before bed and everything in between. We trust these products, we use them every day, they're part of our lives. But have you ever stopped to consider what's inside them? Many of these products are a cocktail of ingredients, some of which we can't even pronounce. But what if I told you that some of these chemicals could potentially disrupt our hormones? It's a startling thought, isn't it? But don't worry, we're here to help you navigate through this information to understand better and to make informed choices. So let's dive deeper into what's actually in these products. You might be surprised to learn about the chemicals hiding in your favorite skincare products. Let's take a closer look, unmasking these hidden elements one by one. First up, parabens. These are preservatives widely used in skincare products to prevent the growth of bacteria and mold, thereby extending the shelf life of the product. They are often found in items like moisturizers, makeup and even shaving gels. Next, we have phthalates. These are versatile chemicals used to increase the flexibility and softness of plastics. In skincare products, they're often used to enhance the spreadability of a product, making it easier to apply and more comfortable on the skin. You can typically find them in products like nail polishes, hairsprays and perfumes. Then there are fragrances. Now, who doesn't love a good scent? But fragrance in an ingredient list can be a catch-all term for thousands of different chemicals used to create a particular scent. These can be found in almost every skincare product, from your shampoo to your favorite night cream. And let's not forget about formaldehyde-releasing preservatives. These are used in many cosmetic products to help prevent microbes from growing. But as the name suggests, these chemicals slowly release a small amount of formaldehyde over time. Finally, we have sulfates. They are cleansing agents that create the lather you see in products like shampoos and body washes. They are effective at removing dirt and oils, but can also strip the skin of its natural moisture. These chemicals each serve a purpose in your skincare products, making them last longer, smell better, feel better on your skin, or work more effectively. But it's essential to remember that just because something serves a purpose, doesn't mean it's beneficial in the long run. So we've unmasked the common chemicals in your skincare products. They're not all villains, but they're not exactly superheroes either. The question now is, what happens when these chemicals interact with our bodies? These chemicals don't just stay on the surface of your skin, they can actually disrupt your hormones. That's right, some of these substances have the potential to penetrate the skin and enter your bloodstream. This means that they're not just affecting the outer layer of your skin they're potentially impacting your entire body. Now, let's talk about endocrine disruptors. The endocrine system, for those unfamiliar, is a complex network of glands and hormones that regulate many of our body's critical functions, including growth, development, metabolism, reproduction, and mood. Endocrine disruptors are chemicals that interfere with this system. They can mimic your natural hormones, block them, or alter the way they work in your body. This can lead to a host of health issues, from developmental problems to immune system dysfunction, and even cancer. So, which chemicals in skincare products can act as endocrine disruptors? Let's go over a few examples. First, we have parabens. These are widely used as preservatives in cosmetics and personal care products. They can mimic estrogen in your body, which may lead to hormonal imbalances. Next, there's phthalates. These are used to enhance the flexibility and softness of plastics and are often found in fragrant skincare products. Phthalates can interfere with the function of your hormones and have been linked to reproductive issues. Lastly, we have triclosan. This is an antibacterial agent often found in soaps, deodorants and toothpaste. Triclosan can alter hormone regulation and disrupt thyroid function. These are just a few examples, but they serve to illustrate the potential risks associated with some of the chemicals found in everyday skincare products. It's a troubling thought, isn't it? These substances, meant to make us look and feel better, could be wreaking havoc on our bodies from the inside out. Now that we know the potential risks, what can we do about it? Well, that's a question we'll tackle in our next scene. Stick around, because understanding the problem is only the first step in creating a healthier skincare routine. Choosing safer skincare products doesn't have to be a daunting task. Imagine strolling through the skincare aisle, confronted by a myriad of options. 
The secret to making an informed choice lies in understanding the ingredients list. This is where our journey towards healthier skincare begins. First off, beware of the dirty dozen. This refers to 12 commonly used chemicals that could potentially disrupt your hormones. They can hide under various names on labels. Parabens, for instance, might appear as methylparaben or propylparaben. Pethylates might be listed as DEHP, BBP or DBP. Learning to identify these can be your first line of defense. Secondly, remember that less is more. Products with a long list of ingredients are often packed with unnecessary chemicals. Instead, opt for products with fewer, simpler ingredients. This rule of thumb applies to all types of skincare products, from moisturizers to sunscreens. Now let's talk about alternatives. Organic and natural skincare options are becoming increasingly popular, but be aware that natural doesn't always mean safe. Even natural products can cause allergies or skin reactions. So always do a patch test before using a new product. If you're wondering where to start, look for certifications. Certified organic products must meet rigorous standards, ensuring they're free from harmful chemicals. Similarly, products with the Made Safe seal have been screened for known toxins. Consider DIY skincare. With a few simple ingredients like honey, oats, and aloe vera, you can whip up your own moisturizers and face masks. Not only is this fun, but it also puts you in control of what goes onto your skin. Lastly, embrace the power of technology. Numerous apps can scan product barcodes and provide a breakdown of ingredients. This can be a handy tool in your quest for healthier skincare. In conclusion, navigating the skincare aisle is all about being an informed consumer. Do your research, understand labels, and make conscious choices. Remember, knowledge is power when it comes to protecting your health. SceneScript. Transforming your skincare routine can be an empowering journey and a journey worth embarking on as it leads us to healthier habits and better skin. But it's not just about a prettier reflection in the mirror. It's about taking control of what goes into our bodies and being mindful of our overall well-being. So where do we start? First, it's essential to read the labels. The long list of ingredients may seem daunting, but don't be discouraged. Start by identifying and avoiding harmful chemicals. These can be anything from parabens to phthalates and even some fragrances. It takes time to familiarize yourself with these terms, but there are resources available to make this easier. Next, opt for products with simpler, more natural ingredients. Ingredients that you can pronounce and perhaps even recognize. Think aloe vera, chamomile or tea tree oil. These are kinder to your skin and less likely to disrupt your hormones. But remember, not all natural ingredients are good for everyone. It's essential to listen to your skin. Patch test new products and observe how your skin reacts. If it's happy, you're on the right track. If it's not, don't be disheartened. This process is about learning what works for you. While you're transitioning to a healthier skincare routine, remember to be patient. Your skin may take time to adjust and that's okay. It's a journey, not a race. Don't forget to hydrate and nourish your body too. What you put inside affects your skin as much as what you apply on it. Plenty of water, fresh fruits and vegetables, and less processed food can work wonders for your complexion. And lastly, consistency is key. Stick to your healthier routine, even on busy days or when you're traveling. Your skin is your largest organ, and it deserves your attention and care every single day. So take that step towards a healthier skincare routine. It's not just about beauty, but about a holistic approach to your health. It's about making conscious choices for your well-being and the well-being of our planet. Your skin and your hormones will thank you. So, what have we learned today? We've taken a journey through the world of skincare, unmasking the hidden chemicals that often lurk in our daily products. From our morning face wash to our night creams, we've discovered that these seemingly harmless products can harbor ingredients that may disrupt our hormones and potentially affect our health. We've understood that it's not just about skincare, it's about healthcare. The relationship between our skin and our products isn't always as healthy as we'd like it to be. And navigating the skincare aisle can be tricky with so many brands and products promising miracles. But don't despair. We've also embraced a healthier skincare routine, exploring safer alternatives and understanding the importance of reading labels. It's about making informed choices for the sake of our skin and our overall well-being. Stay informed, stay healthy, and remember, your skin is worth it.